Welcome back to Adventures with Bob and Steph. Today's adventure, we are flying out to Anaheim and heading back to Disneyland. So excited, so excited to take you with us too. Come on and join us on the adventures. Let the adventure begin. Well, guess what, folks? I get to be in command of a 737. This is really amazing. I'm up in the cockpit. The pilots have invited me up to uh, sit in the, the captain seat. Is that right? Yeah. So, this is really incredible. I'm able to actually handle the uh, yoke. Is that what this is called? So, we'll go forward with the thrust over. And uh, we're, we're just about ready to go. Well, it's that time. It is 8.30 in the morning, and we're getting ready to cross the street to Disneyland! I'm so excited. Of course, no trip to Disney would be uh, complete without the epic shot of the railroad station. Main Street, right behind it. Oh, we're back. I love this. Here you leave today and enter the world of yesterday, tomorrow, and fantasy, and it is so true. But the minute you walk under that bridge, you enter an entirely different world. A world of the past, a world of the present, and a world of what the future holds. It's Disneyland and it is amazing. Right off the bat, we got characters out. This is awesome. Oh my God. <laughs> Chip and Dale, Mickey, Donald, Minnie. <laughs> Oh, it's so good being back. It is really so good being back. And uh, here in a couple minutes, we're going to meet up with family and celebrate uh, some birthdays and enjoy uh, Disneyland once again for probably the bajillionth time. But you know what? It just never gets old. It never gets old. This place is always wonderful, always new, always fresh. Oh, it looks like we picked a great day to come to Disneyland. It's not too busy. Actually, it's kind of nice. Beautiful, warm day. A few puffy clouds in the sky, but other than that, the crowds are light. It looks like we got a good day for rides and for Disney fun. First treat of the day is going to be a strawberry dole whip sundae. Strawberry dole whip, fresh diced strawberry shortcake, strawberry drizzle. We're going to give that a whirl for $7.29. Not a bad deal. This thing is looking mighty nice. All right, so we're at the Tropical Hideaway behind the Tiki Room, right next to the Jungle Cruise. And again, we're gonna give this a whirl. This looks mighty good. It looks decadent, actually, is what it looks. So apparently it has real chunks of strawberry in it. Oh, wow. Wow. You ever have something so sweet and so good that you kind of Gives you that wang in the back of the jaw there. Ooh, that's good stuff. Oh my gosh, yeah. That is so good. Okay, so if you do end up getting this uh, strawberry float, just be prepared for the actual sweet factor to kick in because I barely finished half of it and already I'm just like, oh, doing the sugar shimmy. It's good. But like I said, you'll get sweeted out pretty quick with this particular dessert. And we are joined 
by our family and friends. Yes. On the left is Jessica, in the middle is Hannah, and on the right, Mike Land. <laughs> Here we go. Love it when the march of hands comes through. Look at this. This is hardly there's hardly any crowd at all. This is really awesome. On a Saturday right now. Yeah. I love it. What a great feeling. I miss this place when we're not here. Isn't that funny? This is something about it. You can't deny it. It's my childhood. It's our childhood and our adulthood. Yeah. We love it. And our We're kids' just... childhood. Yeah, that they too. They were raised here too. Lots of memories here. Yep. Not only memories of the past, but memories in the making. So yes. this is awesome. Now right above the Disneyland Fire Department, the firehouse, is Walt's apartment where he spent a lot of time here. You can actually take tours of uh, Walt's apartment. All the furnishings, the uh, decorations inside, all the same as when he was here. Once more, we are on the Casey Jr. train. Of course, we get the caboose. That's our preference, so. Ladies and gentlemen. All aboard. Ladies and girls. Let's go. All aboard. That's awesome. <laughs> what do you think of that? That was pretty cool. <laughs> You're such a kid. So we're waiting for Rise of the Resistance. I think we have a boarding time of what? 12, something, 12 yeah. 15, something like that. So yeah. while we're waiting, we figure we'd hop over to Hungry Bear, get some shade and maybe a little quick bite to eat. I got a cheeseburger. She got the regular kid's burger because she's such a kid, once again. <laughs> Just ahead is the most treacherous part of our journey. That island on the starboard side often hides the scourge of the seas. No thirsty pirates. So you're getting a shuttle to Bacara. Are you scared? No? No, I'm alright. Are you okay? Yeah. Are you good with space flight? What? Are you pretty good with space flight? Uh, yeah. 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 Oh. Stormtroopers. <laughs> oh no! Troopers. Landspeeder, how many's in your unit? Two, you're just gonna stay with them. 
it's a prisoner transfer. <laughs> Runaway railway. Boom, boom, boom. Welcome aboard, folks. We're ready for a relaxing ride around the park. Oh, yo, yo. How do you do? Hey, you sure you take good care of our friends? What you got there, hun? Yeah, the cutest little lunchbox. We have not seen metal lunchboxes since we were kids. And how much is it? Thirty-nine ninety-nine. Thirty-nine ninety-nine. But that's a lot cute. of other cute merchandise just outside Mickey's Runaway Railway. Oh, that's a cute jacket. That's Mickey's cute Runaway jacket. Railway. Yeah, with Mickey and Minnie on it. And actually, I like that one. Those and how much is that? Sixty-four ninety-nine. Sixty-four ninety-nine. Oh, look at the hats. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's cute. That is really cute. $34.99. And you get your receipt with it. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> All right, so here we are over at Bingo Barbecue, and Jessica decided to try out the, what is it? The Adventures Platter. What's, what is in it? Uh, so it's got two choices of skewers, and then you got rice, and it comes with couscous. Okay, and the skewers are spicy? Yeah, so I got two different ones. I got the Bengal beef skewers, which has the Zulu sauce in it, and then I got the Benyon beef skewers, which is a hot and spicy sauce. And uh, how hot and how spicy? It's got some kick. It's got a, <laughs> I'm a little sweaty right now. It looks good, though. Yeah, yeah. So pretty zoom, good. Zoom in on that a little bit. That's the that's the Zulu sauce, and then that's the hot and spicy sauce. All right. Overall, what would you rate it out of ten? <laughs> About a nine, eight or nine, huh? Eight. All right, that's pretty good. Eight's good. Oh, and how much did you pay for it? $19 with some taxes. Woo, that's a little on the high side. $18 and some change. All right. Is this haunted room actually stretching? Or is it your imagination? Mm -hmm. And consider this dismaying observation. This chamber has no windows and no doors. <laughs> which offers you this chilling challenge to find a way out <laughs> of course there's always my way
to take a ride on Pirates. Blue Bayou over there. Smooth sailing. Keep your arms and hands in the boat. Plaza Inn, right? Plaza Inn. And uh, something. One of our go to's here at Disneyland. They serve specialty chicken, chicken. pot roast, penne pasta, chapoodle. Chapoodle pineapple glazed salmon. Chapoodle salmon. Specialty salad, and of course, kid meals, kid meals and pasta. So, pretty reasonably priced too for the uh, size meal you get. So, let's go get something to eat. All right, so we're inside the Plaza Inn. We got a really nice seat right out here in the, what would this be called, an aviary or? I'm not exactly sure what it's called, but it's got all the bird cages, so I think it's an aviary. Anyway, so what did you get for lunch? You actually got the kids meal. I got the kids meal, the tenders, because I mean, the chicken's good here, but it's such a large portion. I can't do that. So I got that and I got a side salad. And then we're gonna try the the hundredth anniversary chiffon pie, lemon chiffon pie. So we're gonna give that a shot. We're gonna try that, and see how that is. All right. All right. And what and did you get? I just went ahead and got the uh, marinara pasta with a little bit of Parmesan cheese and a breadstick and a soda, of course. Kind of my go-to, really. And I got the apple juice. Enjoy. All right. So Steph is about ready to try the hundredth anniversary. Chiffon tarts. You're gonna dig into that and tell us what you think. It's gonna be white chocolate. Let's. Oh yeah, I gotta oh, take a bite of that. Gonna be, it's gonna be chocolate. Oh, it's got the three fairies on it for Cinderella's castle. It's really cute. It's regular chocolate. 100 years of wonder. Um, yep, tastes like chocolate. I'll take a bite of that. Now for the chiffon pie. Yeah? What do you like about it? Obviously, I love a great cracker crust rather than regular pie crust. Is it overly sweet or is it? It, it, it is not overly sweet. It's, it could use a little more lemon, but it's, it's pretty good. So I guess uh, kind of like a key lime pie, but Lemon. Okay. So it's pretty good. Alright, so I'm gonna give this a try now. So is that graham cracker crust on the outside? Yeah. And then cream cheese on the inside? No, it's a lemon chiffon, like a, it's kind of like a lemon, lemon meringue. meringue kind of, okay. Yeah, but without meringue, but it's got whipped cream. And then whipped cream on top with yeah. uh, sh small shreds of lettuce. I, <laughs> I hope there is no lettuce in that. So meringue on top. Whipped with, cream. Whipped cream on top with small zest of lemon. Small zest of lemon. Thank you. That's the way I was looking for. Yeah, it's kind of refreshing actually. Yeah, it is. It's getting ready to do radiator, radiator spray. Erase, eraser. We're getting ready to do radiator eraser. Radiator spray. Radiator, radiator, radiator spray. Just We're getting ready to race. Yeah. Ah! 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 Oh no! Slow down! You're not racing yet. Just throw a meter into town to get in. Meter! Now you look like a real race car. 
Going up to the starting line. Okay. Okay. Takes more than your tires to win a race. I mean, you push it. cars land at night. I mean, look at all of the neon down the street. Ah, isn't that fantastic? Nighttime has fallen in DCA and Steph is having a little bit of dinner. What are you having, Steph? Ramen? I am having the pork ramen from the Lucky Fortune Cookie. I don't know if they've changed the name of it since. How's the ramen? It's, it's okay. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah. Sweet. Broth sounded good. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a destroyed uh, mac and cheese bowl there. Pretty good stuff. That's for you. Yeah. And what did you have? You had a sandwich, right? With the deli sandwich. You had uh, salami, prosciutto, and pepperoni in it. With and? arugula, onions, on sourdough bread. Thumbs up? <laughs> Amazing. Good stuff. Really All good right. Sandwich. Awesome. family tradition. Mint chocolate chip ice cream, the Firehouse Dalmatian Mint Sunday here in Disneyland. Mm. Always so good. You guys want a bite? That is good stuff. What is that? That goes back to old times, doesn't it? That does. She's going to dig right in right now. Oh, wow. wow, that's a throwback. I forgot what I forgot tastes, what it tasted like, but wow. Tastes like old times. It tastes exactly the same. That's awesome. Yep. Worth it then. Worth it. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, well that wraps up another trip to Disneyland another adventure at Disneyland and we had such a good time Always. and we had a, such a good time bringing you guys with us hope you enjoyed the video we'll see you next time on adventures with Bob and Steph more adventures, more adventures to, to come, come.